My name is Alex Gubler and I'm one of the engineering TAs. The C-Perch is one of our two very large projects that the students work on while they're here during their session. The C-Perch is more of a hands-on experiment opportunity that the students get to have where they're building two ROV robots to uh, run one on top of water, one underwater. Over the course of the week, they're working on electrical circuits, uh, building the control box from scratch by themselves, learning how to solder and how to come up with all the controls and buttons and toggle switches to make the ROVs run, where they have to make sure they're communicating to make sure that they're coming together with one uh, successful product in the end. I'm Skylar and I'm from Mineola, Florida. With the Sea Perch Challenge, I helped a lot with the electrical components and trying to put together and fix the control box. We worked well together, like we always helped out, but we never knew who to cheer on because we split up into two separate groups to work on each robot. During the challenge, we were jumping back and forth between groups. Uh, my name is Alberto Luis Palacio Martinez, and I'm from Los Angeles, California. My role in the Seaport competition was a soldier, and I worked with the electric components and I assisted in the creation of both, both ROVs while making sure that all the kinks with the electrical wires were worked out. Our group felt that we worked really hard on it and we felt really confident in our ability to win. So when we got there, we were really, really um, energized and hyped for what we were about to do and I feel we really did it exceptionally well. Um, well, I didn't actually know we won, so that makes me really happy. Like, very, very happy. I don't actually know what to say right now. <laughs>